I've come a couple of miles east of Burnham on Crouch, a long walk up the sea wall. We've come to this lovely beach, and on a day like this, if this was anywhere near a resort, this would be jam packed, but we are the only people here. I've brought a couple of spinning rods. We're going to have a little go off the beach into the river. And you know what? I'm not expecting much, but it's just nice to be out on a day like this. I've just found a little baby slow worm. Dad, Dad, you can't see it on the camera. I can now. We better let him go. That is um, one of only six reptiles found in the UK. That is a legless lizard. It don't mean that he's been drinking. But you can tell it's a lizard because he's got eyelids. And snakes don't have eyelids. Come on, let's let him go. Let's put him back where we found him. We found the slow worm under this wood. Here, Fred, let him go. Put him back under there. He's exactly where he was. He was laying on that cloth. Hey, look, that must sort of feel familiar to him now. Uh, there is, but... He's gone. Hey, all right, Max? Yeah. Getting his wetsuit on. He thinks he's going to go skinny dipping. <laughs> Right, the water's a bit murky close in in the shallows to chuck lures. I can notice that there's um, a clear patch about a hundred, a couple of hundred yards offshore. Well, about about hundred yards offshore, and I'm going to cast these sabikis into it and just hope that there's um, with a four ounce lead. Just hope that there's anything out there, like some scully bass, some herring, whatever else. Want to take um, a sabiki? Let's give it a go. Right, so um, I cast out the uh, sabikis a few times, there weren't much happening. So I've baited them, tipped them off, and I've just left them out there. I've left my tripod in the van, so I've just used a pile of rocks. And jammed the rod in there like that. That'll be all right for now. And if any little basslets out there want to take that, that'll register rather well on there, I should think. That'll have to do. Just had a decent bite. Is it still on? Yeah, there we go. I'm in there. Oh, I can see that. Tiny little bass, first one for me of the year. Gailed it. On uh, you can, but it's spiky, Max. I'd leave it if I was you. Film it. Oh. <laughs> I ain't even going to touch him because um, he's only tiny, and I don't like removing the slime and that if I'm not going to eat it. So, there, yeah, Max, not film that. Oh. It's going to shake him off. Yeah. Hey, up. There he oh. goes. He's away. You're not filming, Max. I was. Bye, Bass. No, that's a better one. It's a big old bass. That's a big old bass. <laughs> it's not big. It's still only a schoolie, but um, he's bigger than the last one. He's fair locked in. Ah, you bastard. He's, he's cut me, look, he's nabbed me, look. He's done me with his spike and his anal fin. 
<coughs> but uh, no worries. Right, beautiful little bass. Um, nice to see that they're actually on the feed and they're coming up the river now. Even if I wanted to take this, I couldn't. In 2018, there's a complete ban on recreational fishing if you want to take bass. They've got to be released back into the water, whatever size they are. I would release this one anyway because it's undersized. Right, put it back. He's just trying to find deeper water to get in there. There we go. The best done me. They always do me. Freddy's got himself a fish. Oh, it just came off, I swear. Not all the way to the top, that's it. Get him out. Way Max has caught a bass. Yeah, let me get the sun behind me. That's a nice one, isn't it, Max? Yeah. You happy with that, son? Yeah. Oh, it's nearly all in his mouth. We've had a couple of hours fun in the sun. We had three bass, uh, a load of missed bites, Freddy. He lost a fish in the surf that he said was bright red. I didn't see it, so I can only assume that that was a gurnard. I'm not sure there's any red mullet round here. I know they get them a bit further up the coast in um, Walton. I heard somebody talk about catching them there, but it's probably a gurnard. I've got to go work later. Such a pain in the neck, so I've got to call it a day now. But that was fun for a couple of hours just to come down here.